Welcome back to the bicycle journey. This is Europa 360, day 52. Just after midday, I'm in the second half of the 100. 100 miles, that is, about mile 55. Shooting for about 110 today. I'm still in Hungary. If I continue with this pace, I could be in Serbia in about two hours, and then on and on. What I wanted to say a little bit about the anatomy of a bicycle tour, Today I've spent a lot of time on a gravel road up on top of a levee. It's been spectacular, by the way. Danube on the right. On my left, across these fields, I can still hear the biggest trucks. That's where the, probably a secondary road. I don't think it's an M road, the Autobahn roads in this country. The anatomy of a bike tour is something like this. I start with some bones. I lay them out. I might piece a few of them together. I might just leave them separate. Maybe I'll finish an elbow or a knee or a finger. Places I want to go to like Budapest. But I'll leave a lot of it unfinished. As the tour approaches, I'll have gathered a little more data. I'll fill in a little more. Maybe some tendon and ligament. And start to assemble some muscle. I'll have a rough idea where I'm going. Now at this point, you know you're thinking about an organism. That's the metaphor for the bike journey, the routes you go, the places you find yourself. No one says your bike journey's gotta be pretty. No one says your organism's gotta be pretty. So for example, if you wanna ride straight out and straight back, the dreadful out and back versus the elegant loop, Europa 360 is a epic loop. For some reason I just am drawn to loops. But however you want to ride it, you'll see kinks in my chains. Not literally, I hope. <laughs> On my journeys where you say, what the heck did he go there for? He could have gone straight. There are reasons for that. Now, back to the assembly of the tour. I don't always take the most sensible path. That's okay. Now building more, building more. Now I'm on the tour. I'm starting to fill in the spaces, bring in the muscle and the skin. I know where I'm going. I've got a route, but I don't hesitate to change it. I might ride a little east or a little west of that line. Generally, I maintain the direction, though there have been some significant uh, exceptions. Uh, case in Missouri for example well that's it you know when you get to uh, the end of each day you know you've got a polished piece of something you get to the end of the tour it looks polished too but I like to keep it a little less than polished before I and during my journeys that's it folks ciao